Hi and welcome to the video. In this video I'm just going to show you how to add a subdomain to an existing Fasthost hosting package. Now this way I'm going to show you isn't a true subdomain. Uh, all it is going to do is uh, add a directory to your existing hosting package that people get redirected to and that will become clear a little later on. If you want a true subdomain the only way you can do that is to add a new hosting package and used as the domain name you would use your subdomain so blog.fastestwebinars.com as the domain name for the hosting package and then it would be its own completely separate entity with its own ftp space and you can have a different operating system if you wanted to but this video is going to show you how to add uh, add one to an existing hosting package so we go to web hosting and my website is going to be listed here and I'm going to add this to fastestwebinars.com so I'm just going to click on that and we're going to go to subdomain manage subdomains here and we're going to see I've already got a few existing ones um, so I've got blog.fastestwebinars.com and that's the one I'll quickly show you how to use uh, in, in how to manage the files for it but if you want to create a new one you just click create new you subdomain there but it's really important to note what's going to happen here is anyone who visits blog.fastestwebinars.com is just going to be redirected to a subfolder of fastestwebinars.com okay so if we go to fastestwebinars.com this is just my uh, website um, if we go to blog dot, that's going to go to forward fastestwebinars.com forward slash blog. So if you want to add content to that subdomain, if we go into our FTP program, um, this is my main website. So I'm in just in HT docs. What I would need to do is create a new directory for blog, uh, go into there and just add any content you want your customers to see or your visitors to see. Uh, I've just got a very basic index HTML just to show you it works. And if we just refresh that now, we can see that that's just a test index for our hello world. Um, so that's how you would manage content for that. If you do, like I said, if you do want to add a true subdomain in that, um, in that you've uh, got a completely separate FTP space, then you would need to add it as a hosting package. Um, I won't go through the whole process of adding a new package, but if you've got one of our um, one of our web hosting packages that comes with add-on websites, I'll just quickly show you how where you would add uh, a new website that you could use as a subdomain. So you, you can see I've got some here. So bah.fastestwebinars.com, boost.fastestwebinars.com, they're both their own hosting packages. So if we go into our um, momentum web hosting package because that has additional websites with it it's one of the higher range ones and then we can go down here and go to add on websites here and through here we could add a new website and i'll just show you where you would add it so add new website i'm gonna have it as linux And so you choose a domain name. So this is where you'd have it. So if we wanted to have blog.fastestwebinars, we would just add it like that and use that domain. And that's all there is to it. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye for now.